All right, item four, electric current and its origin are used. Just as the um, steam is an invisible agent with which the pressure is applied in order to drive the steam locomotive, this current invisible agent with the pressure applied but in order to drive the electrical and diesel electrical locomotives. Electric current is measured in amperes and gauged in temper and t termed amber is employed with electrical circuits to show the volume of the current that is being fed to the circuit. Before the current may be fouled with the current circuit, the two conditions must also be provided that they are. A complete circuit or path must be provided from the source of the supply, therefore the resistance back to the source of the supply. The source of the supply takes the form of the generator and storage battery pressure, which is usually called the voltage or electrical motive force, must be made and available to push the current through the circuit. The voltmeter is gauged in which measures the voltage pressure and available for the first current through the circuit. Therefore, in any higher voltage available to the generator is the amount of the current with which it must be pushed through the circuit. On a diesel electric locomotive, the diesel engine is used to drive the generator in suitable size, thus the provided with the voltage pressure necessary to push the current vehicle cables contractor to the traction motor on electric locomotive voltage and pressure is obtained by the overhead riding the push current viva cables contract with the traction motors associated with the powerhouse diesel engine, coal fired barrel boilers, sometimes force of the failing water used to drive the generators is suitable to the capacity of those primary movers feed maintain the voltage pressure and overhead wiring. All right, this shows the main tension, auxiliary high tension wire, panographic pivot cars, panographic isolation switch, voltmeter number one end, um, 160 amperes, 18 amperes, 10 amperes, 9 amperes AM, switches, resistant reverser, supply main generator, um, com number computer, computer, um, 45 inch diameter wheels. Pivot cars, total number of wheel box, traction motor, armatures over buffers, traction motors, switches, slider, main generators, resistance, reversers, reversers, number two, and app, um, cab. Driver's control panel. This is the driver's control panel. Voltage pressure, which is maintained overhead riding the use of the electrical locomotive with electric trains, maintained about 150 volts, um, fi sorry, 1500 volts. The under certain circumstances, the line voltage warrant vary up and down with two or 300 volts, but at the all time, they're regarding with a high voltage, high tension current. Great care is necessary to avoid the risk of the human contact with which the location of any loca connections is within about the loca locomotive. Remember, well, um, well is also the most, mo most metals unbroken in the jet water, but then we'll also, we'll also conduct, uh, can, will be, uh, also act as conductor for the current. The following items considered high tension equipment. The pantograph, the connection to all roof rigging, all equipment housed in both number one and number two high tension compartments, a volt meter in each of the cab, the mo motors, driving four auxiliary machines associated with the cable connections, six traction motors, cable connections. Also, this equipment is reliable, re reasonably well secured against human contact. You can get the high tension current from any of the locomotive low the panographs isolate them from closing the respective isolation cocks. If the panographic can be lowered, use the hook switch stick hook stick to open the panographic switch. If it, it must never be assumed that any of the panographics have either moved, moved in either direction with a visual inspection. Item 5. Circuit breakers and switches and fuse. Electrical circuit may be described as a, pan, a path of which the which current is clo um, clo caused to flow together with the, the source of supply with the current flow. Usually a generator storage battery with equipment being operated. Fuses broke and protect the circuit within and the switches the circuit breakers with control and the current flow. A closed circuit is complete with the circuit breaker with where the current would flow through. The items described above the open circuit breaker, potential circuit breaker is describing where to do some of the breaks for the total path of the current current cannot flow. Since one of the essentials of the current flow is complete circuit with the opening of the switch and the circuit breaker and when the burning out of the fuse will cause an open circuit. A switch and circuit breaker may therefore describe an item to provide with the control with the current flow of fuses, safety device placed in the circuit breaker circuit to protect the circuit from harmful surge for the current. The action of the fuse therefore is automatically open the circuit to prevent the further current flow where the harmful high current volt surge is present. With the cartridge type of the fuse, the test strip of the conduction will iron that some printed, um, predetermined fuse valve with the value is used. Thus, the, boy, the current surge appear with the fuse wire fuse with the burns and the burn become broken and disconnecting the circuit. On a class 40, on 46 class locomotive, there are nine cartridges. The fuses are employed in the various circuits. In the auxiliary high tension circuit, there are one to 160 amper fuse with the protects the auxiliary circuit, 150 amper with fuse with the protects the supply generator motor, two 18 amper fuse with the respectively protect the two compressor motors. Two nine point nine and a half amper fuses to protect the four volt four volt meters. This picture of the ten low tension panel number two end. All right, this show, circuit shows the battery with an opening on the switch, uh, with an open switch open motor to the motor to the conductor, and simple electrical circuit. 
um, this shows the battery switch closed, um, also motor, motor open circuit broken at the X and Y end, um, this shows the, I guess the short circuit conductor touching the X and Y with the battery to go into the motor and through the fuses, the generator going through uh, different parallel circuit lamps, a uh, generator going through a series of circuits of mo motors, or lamps, I guess, yes, a series of generators circulating the lamps. The few, fuse test panel, spare fuses, motor circuit, cutout circuit breakers. These are your fuses. Um, this shows your fan motor miniature circuit breaker, fan type delay reserve, fan type circuit breaker. In low tension circuit, there are three fuses that are there are one, the, the 100 amper supply generator fuse with protect the control circuit, the 100 amper battery fuse, um, battery positive fuse, and the 100 amp battery and negative fuse for the protect the battery for the batteries. Before any of the fuse circuit is handled for any reason, including the renewal of the corresponding circuit, must be isolated opening control circuit breaker. The very good reason for the precaution is that while burnt out of the fuse, they automatically disconnect the original circuit, contact the hand made by providing the new short and short new and short path of the circuit that. The human body, there's no, there's another protective device employed with low reason circuit. The termed thermal circuit breaker. This is an item of the circuit breaker, which is inbuilt with a thermal stri strip, which reacts to the like of the fuse. And so far, that there is a harmful current surge appear for the thermal strip. It relaxes, strips the circuit breaker open, thus opening the circuit. And like the cartridge type fuse renewal is not necessary, although allow the thermal strip at a short time to cool off. This resets the switch. Never hold the thermal circuit breaker at on position. This will defeat its purpose. All right, item five: magnetic type switches, electromagnetic type contactors. These two devices, since they basically switch with an employee with the 46 class local mode to connect and disconnect very the route over the current flow. As these are employed with the high tension circuit, it's necessary that they be remotely controlled with the opening and closing action. Example: the magnetic tips of the switch of the two contactors, which apply to disconnect the high tension current feed to the two air compressor motors. Example: the electromagnetic type of the contactors are six line switches that are starting the resistant contactors. All of these necessary housed in the high tension compartment of the local mode. Each of these types really relies on the principal temporary magnetic to close and then to hold them. And close the spring with which it opens them temporarily. Magnetism is destroyed. The closing of the contractor phase for the contact of the high tension current with the opening of the phase and discontinue. It disconnects the high tension current with which the magnetic type switches. The solenoid is in fixed in one arm of the contractor control circuit with a supply motor generator storage batteries. You the engine drive the oil. The coil, while which never could become magnetized, and thus the attractive holds the second arm of the contractors. Well, the electromagnetic type contractor solenoid is used with a temporary magnet to control the passage compressor air. The panographic control of reserve air is two small air cylinders. For your basic electro-pneumatic, electro-pneumatic contactors, um, interlocks. We're going to start with the control air reserve at 80 pounds going through the exhaust, which runs through the electro-pneumatic pole plate with a push-button switch on your positive and negative. Also, the from the control air reserve through the exhaust of the electro-pneumatic valve goes to the moisture drain to another valve, which can, um, with the contactor interlocker opens on a positive, positive to the negative switch gate. Um, then it goes to a... The current goes to the current goes to another contractor opening interlocking switch. All right, the piston and the cylinder is linked with the moving the control arm. The, the thrust of the air piston forces together the hold of the contractor fake for the permitting of the current flow. When the control current would switch off with the solenoid magnesium to spare spring reverse to the control air valve, which cuts off the current control air of the piston, air piston exhaust the air of the air piston. The spring new force of the air piston back in the control force of the air part of thus cutting off and flowing the high tension current. In summary, therefore, the operating either of the magnetic valve type switch with electromagnetic control and contact with the control of the flow with the high tension current with low tension control circuit is necessary to operate the solenoid column. Well, the um, control current is 120 volts supplied with the supply motor and uh, supply motor generator in the next store the next ne ne nest of the storage batteries to uh, operate with the electromagnetic contactor in addition to the control control current to operate the solenoid control air pressure is required to operate the contactor air piston the electromagnetic arrangement is often referred to as the magnetic valve when the magnetic valve is attached directly to the high tension contactor the term is uh, the term is a unit switch since the unit switches are used are housed housed together in the high tension compartments of the, with the, of the locomotive they are referred to as switch groups. They are air cock terms of switch group isolating the co air cock is located in the supply pipe when the panographic control reservoirs and switch groups in the machinery compartment. 
Item 6, employment of high tension 1500 volt current, 46 class locomotives. When the 1500 volt current is available to be with the pantograph of the wizard electrical and locomotive 10 higher tension machines are required to be driven with such in order with locomotive that may function the training haulage. Six of the machines are called with the traction motor, four of the machines are called auxiliary machines and named as follows. The supply motor generator, the exciter motor generator, the number one air compressor motor, the number two air compressor motor. Six traction motor when driven with a high tension current will each of the right locomotive axles to which the connected with us can Contributed with the attractive effort of locomotive. Traction motors are identified being the number of running, the running from number one end of the locomotive to traction number one end of the motors number two, three, and following the number one bogey truck number four, five, and six motors following then that order number two in the bogey truck. The current being fed with the number one, two, and three motors is read on the ammeter, second on the right, on the driver's side station, the ammeter nearest the fireman observer station reads the current being fed the motors four, five, and six in the trailing hull is the current reading on the bolt and the ammeter should agree, except where the one bank of the motor has been isolated and disagreement meaning that the amateurs certain motors are rotating faster than others, therefore the wheel slipping is occurring. Our traction motor high tension blower arrangement. You have your high compartment tension supply uh, supply main generator main generator traction motors high tension compartments. To ventilate and prevent the intrusion of the form of the traction motor, the high tension compartments are forced to draw a supply. Attached supply motor generator and auxiliary motor generators, the large potential figure type fan blower up when these machines are largely volume air pressure fed to the longitudinal duct proportional with the air 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 fed with each of the high tension compartment of each of the six traction motors. All right, this shows 150 volts going through a series of uh, groupings of lamps with 250 volts, um, 150 volt series uh, parallel grouping, uh, 500 volts traction motor combinations. Uh, these actually these are motors, and it doesn't say lamps. So you have a series of grouping of six and six uh, 150 volts uh, series parallel grouping of. Uh, 150 volts with a ground and uh, parallel grouping of uh, 150 volt, 1500 volts to 750 volt traction motor combinations. All right, the issue of the re regenerated brake of the 46 class employed with the fixed traction motor retard with the locomotive. Therefore, the the train during the process of the traction motors are acting on six generators of the conversion electric motor into the generator. Simple matter of requiring the alteration of the component parts, but merely some of the alteration to the current path. The circuits during the employment of the motor, the ammeter of the meter, with extremely right at the driver station reads the amount of the current of the, um, now being regenerated by all six motors in the series combination being used. And if the series parallel combination is being used, then the two banks of the motor are regenerated. Generating the armature ammeter current, which should be multiplied by two. The current showing the field ammeter over that um, meter second from the right reads the strength of the excitation motor for the motor field of supply motor generated when the driven with a high tension current with 1500 volts produced a low tension current with 120 volts, the purpose of which will be described under the instruction dealing with the control of circuit. The exciter motor generator, when driving a high tension of 1500 volt, also produced a low tension current separated from the former machine output. All right, um, I believe we're on the current sh um, supply motor generated when driving the high current and current of 1500 volts produce low tension current at 120 volts. Purpose will be described under the instruction dealing with the control circuit. The six cider motor generated while driving the high tension current. 1500 volts also produce low tension current separated with the former machine output. The current is used to drive the motors of the eight and resistant fans. Also make it possible to convert the six traction motor into the generators. These two um, both mentioned mo mach move machines also have been attached to the armature spindle with a large blower fan for the machines run the two blower run blue blower runs these blowers called traction motor blowers are provided with large volume of the air through the routed traction motor the joint existing the coloring of them and also preventing any induction of metal filings in the brake shoe dust etc all right this is a little bit more complicated 1500 volts panographic isolation switch all right you're from, um this should be the cab one differential overload relay mainly isolation switch auxiliaries um Relays, voltmeters, different voltmeters. Um, your current, current also through the Rio staff line switches, switches, um, traction motor armatures one, two, three, four, five, and six. Armature ammeter overload relay. Um, current. The isolation high tension circuit breaker series of combination traction motors, traction field armature, traction motor fields. Uh, motor E generator. Uh, and, Differential relay and north uh, NC relay former auxiliaries. 
When the motors are both number one and two, air compressors are driven with a high tension and extension. The 1500 volts are induced with the compressor and cool absorbed with the action of the respective compound compressor being so driven. In the summer, the high tension circuit breaker for, um, forks two different paths. The first main high tension from the circuit breaker, circuit, circuit, a high tension circuit, which is directed through the traction motor of the second leg auxiliary high tension circuit, which junctions the branches of the way inside the locomotive to the driving four auxiliary high tension machines. It is quite machine impractical um, to um, drive the four auxiliary machines while not using the other fork of the high tension current to the traction motor. The conditions necessarily take care of the circumstance where the locomotive is standing or coasting. However, the main high tension circuit coast, uh, circuit cannot be used to drive six traction motors unless auxiliary high tension current is functioning because of the later circuit. Ladder circuit it provides the control system of the controlling for the former. All right, item seven, the item, the control circuit. The control circuit, low tension circuit, breaker with the 456 glass, the locomotive 120 volts, supplied, maintained supply motor generator, and S storage batteries to receive the charging supply motor generator, very limited period of the charge fit, held in the storage batteries, a little supply with the control circuit, only with the correct use of the control circuit from this source of supply is in the initial stage of the engine's preparation and emergency of the main line called with the failure supply motor generator, which cannot be corrected. Current from the ab um, above mentioned sources, you, the driver, operate with the pantographs, also a large group of the contact of the contractors will operate with the either of the contact disconnect high tension current with the 10 high tension machines of the locomotive and very high, very path of such. Storage batteries of four six class locomotive that have only limited storage capacity, therefore it's important to get supply manager motor generator really run, or running early in the preparation routine to keep the running during the traffic surfaces. Um, when the end of supplier motor, motor generator is running, it's producing low tension current, but there is no demand on the storage battery current, and the battery charging is taking place. <coughs> I'll continue with yellow lamp, with this um, cab warning with the supply motor generator is not running. If the supply motor generator is 100, 100 amp, the fuse fails and no output of the machine, even though it is running in the battery current, it automatically takes over the supply of the control circuit. This condition is indicated the discharge indication of the ammeter of the battery control will open and open. Also, the exciter motor generator will stall. This is a low tension, low tension panel number two end. All right, additional to the cab heaters and the food heater uh, food heaters will fail. They include with the simplified control schematic diagram should be in study, but the preferred is required. Explain the two-source supply with the control circuit reaction to either source of um, fa failing the battery contact or connecting the dividend dividing point of the source of supply. The contractor is closing automatically if the supply generator is producing control current with the opens automatically and the current being supplied with the supply generator. The device located in low-tension cabinet control of the battery contactor. The device is not shown as called with the reverse current relay, the generator automatic switch, or the battery relay. If the device fails to open with the battery connect and detect with no current will be produced, the supply generator with the battery current will be flow through the back of the battery connect detector. <coughs> Drive the generator motor discharge of the batteries in this process. Item 7, the control circuit explanatory notes on schematics.